you've come to this channel to learn how to style your faux locks, welcome. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for coming back. As you can see, I'm really hyped to get started. If you're new to my channel, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and, you know, support your girl. And if you're old, you're the realest MVP. But let's get right into this video. So for my first style, I basically put my hair to the side, like the entire hair to the side and I'm braiding downwards and I'm making sure to pick every hair from um, the back into the braids and it doesn't have to be perfect, it doesn't have to be so arranged. The point of this style is just to get your hair in a big braid to the side and any hair that does not make it, especially the ones at the back or down at the side you could just tuck it in when you're done braiding and after braiding i just make sure to secure tucking and fluff up the top of the hair because i feel like when there's more volume on the top of the head it looks better and just i'm basically just tucking in the parts that are not secure and then i'm securing them all together with a band and yeah so easy so beautiful For the next time, I'm basically taking up a um, few sections from the top part of my hair and I'm making sure to do this gently because you want to wake up with edges and I see that applying too much pressure on the front part of your hair or around the perimeter of your hair basically makes you lose hair around those areas. So I'm taking a band and I'm just doing this as lightly as possible and I'm putting that hair in a sort of like messy top bun. And I'm just sec I'm securing that into place. So when that's done, I just take the remaining parts of the hair and put it to the side. It looks cute that way, like so. Or you could just section your hair into two parts and put them on each side of your face. For the next style, with my top bun still in place, I'm basically taking out pieces of hair from both sides of my head and I'm just wrapping them and kind of like braiding them but I'm not really braiding them, I'm just wrapping them around each other. When I get to the part of my head where I want the braids to stop, I basically just take two strands and tie them up. You could also use a bobby pin to secure this and it just looks really cute when you're done. So for the next one, I was trying to put my hair in a top bun, like a really huge bun. And for some reasons, I never get it right. Like, for real, I had to leave this clip in for you guys to see, like, the struggle is real out here. It's not roses and peaches for beauty gurus. Anyways, I finally got the hang of it after, like, maybe my third try. And I was just putting my hair into a big, huge bun. And after that, I really hate like the huge bun where it looks all neat and arranged. And for some reason, I really prefer like messy buns. So I just brought out like few strands of my locks hanging, like dangling at each side for a more messy look. And yeah, or on bad hair days, you could just take a scarf, wrap it around your head, wrap it around your head and keep it moving. Like it's literally that simple. Just take two ends for those of you that don't know how to tie a scarf. Take two ends, secure them, and tuck the remaining parts into. Just look at video, man. Just look at video. <laughs> I'm out of words. Yeah. So now I'm doing the African woman dance because I'm feeling all black and proud and I just bought out those two strands because you guys know I hate when things look really put together <laughs> and then this next style I am basically going to be doing a crisscross type of braid so that means I'm taking 
um, one braid and I'm crossing it over the other one and going downwards. So when I get to the back of my head, I am basically going to start braiding it. So that way in the front, it kind of looks like a mohawk, like you have a, um, a crown. <laughs> And that's just what I'm doing. I'm going to turn my back now so you can see what the back looks like. It basically turns into a braid when you get to the back of your head. And you can just secure that with a, a rubber band. You can either do that together, but I don't like to do it together because to me it's just like so much um, weight. And then to join everything together, I just take um, single strands from both sides of my head and put that in place so I had to add this final one because it's more realistic for me it's literally what I do almost every day when I'm going to school and I think everybody can do this if you enjoyed this video as usual don't forget to give me a thumbs up like subscribe rate comment and share and I'll see you in the next one bye guys